thing to do. Lift every voice and sing till earth and heaven rings and ring with the harmonies of liberty. Let our rejoicing rise high as the listening skies, and let it resound loud as a rolling sea. Sing a song. Full of the faith that the dark past has taught us. Sing a song full of the hope that the present has taught us. Facing the rising sun of our new day begun. Let us march on to victory is one. I'm going to do my, my uh, favorite verse. God of our weary years and God of our silent tears, thou who has brought us this far on the way. Thou who has by thy might led us into the light. Keep us forever in the path we pray. Mm -mm -mm. Listen, y'all. There's about four verses to that song, and I figured because it's Black History Month. Let me just go ahead and sing those few verses. I'm sure that I'm not going to get flagged for that. And if I do, then all of us should do something about you too. Because if we can't do the Black Anthem, those of y'all who don't know uh, the Black Anthem, which was written by, uh, what is it, James Weldon Johnson, I think you should look at those words. Look at the words. It's very important that we do. Because a lot of people think, ah, oh, we passed that, we passed that. But we're not. No, we're not. Stony the road we try, bitter the chaste and rot. Are y'all kidding me? Felt in the days when hope unborn had died, yet with a steady beat, have not our weary feet come to the place where our fathers sighed. We right there right now. This is the place where our fathers sighed, okay? Because y'all think we got it bad now. Y'all think that it's bad now. Don't y'all remember all those white boys bought up all them bullets? What you think they bought them up for? To put in their living room and keep them there for safekeeping? You see how all these crazies are taking over the school boards? Huh? These, these people are prepared for war on our asses, okay? Because we got a subgroup as well that don't realize how important that they are in terms of all hands on debt, and they want to eat us. And that's why I always say some of us got to eat our young. We do. Because this is a war, and it's still going on. I mean... <laughs> have not our weary feet are y'all kidding it's a fight every single day and our mental health now is at the point now is very much in question um, very much how we handle adversity how we handle everything because these people have almost succeeded in driving us mad 
the sons and daughters of the strong uh, 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 um, ancestors, you can see them. The weak ones have been driven mad. But we're all going to be lumped together. Okay? And we all going to suffer the consequences. So we better realize just how serious a fight that it is that we really in, y'all. And I ain't saying that to scare nobody because y'all can already. Can't you smell the extinction in your nostrils? Can you smell that? Because something wrong with me, I can't. I can smell the aroma of our extinction in my nostrils. I'm out. If you like what you hear, please like, please subscribe, please share the video. Um, let's grow the channel, you guys. Let's let's let's. Um, um, make it a place where we can have a safe space because there's some uh, things that I talk about on another channel that I don't want to talk on there on here, but I do want like-minded people to get together because we got to look out for our refuge. We really have to make plans and have a house of refuge for us. So with that being said, you guys, I'll see you in the next video. Happy Black History every